friends if you see my previous video yes i'm wearing the same outfit because straight after coming home uh, from Lidl's and unpacking all the shopping i uh, went to poundland for my monthly trip to poundland that's when i go to stock up on some necessities and not necessary things that are not necessary um required for our household but i like little treat every now and again i normally spend around 30 25 30 pounds a month this month even though i didn't have to buy any cleaning products any toilet paper kitchen towels because we had all of them and we bought some in uh, Lidl's as well uh because they were cheaper i spent 40 pounds 39 pounds why to be fair around 10 pounds maybe a bit less it's the things that i'm buying not for myself they're for someone else and i'll be po posting them next week it's a gift for someone very special um and i needed some little bits um to go into the, the parcel so it's mother's day in poland on the 26th of may and uh, it's uh, in poland we celebrate something called name day as well it's like your second birthday and uh, it's my mum's name day uh, on the 3rd of May. So I always um, either ask my sister to buy something and then I give her some money or I order her flowers. So I know that like name day, uh, I post this, I will post this present on the 1st or whatever, on Monday or Tuesday. So I'm afraid it won't get there on time because it's bank holiday in Poland. So uh, I'm sending her late name day, early Mother's Day a gift and then I will order her some flowers on the actual Mother's Day. Um, that's all I can do being so far away. So the first thing I had to buy because I'm posting things to her is the wrapping paper. I don't know, I'm not I'm not sure if I finished with all the shopping yet because uh, there's a couple of more bits that I might want to buy for her but it will either go in a box or in like a like wrapped parcel but wrapping parcel paper one pound quite big one i'm sure it will be just laying around here annoying us in a few weeks time because i hardly ever sent packages but hey it was one pound very cheap um and now to the the actual haul uh i will mention which things are for me which are well i'll mention which things are for my mom so uh both this one obviously for me it's a microwaveable bowl um it's for my stews I take to work. It's just it's annoying me because one of them is not sticking how it should. But I'm sure it will be fine. I just wanted it to keep my leftovers in the fridge either at home or to take it to work. I'm sure I'll make it work. But right now I'm just rushing so it's annoying me. So one pound obviously. Um, it's just to, to keep my stew or my meat in the box. Um... The other thing is, I just need a small frying pan, and uh, I know it's not an amazing quality, but it was one pound, and I just wanted to make my like egg. I want to find out my egg like, sunny side up and all that, so it was one pound. So even if I have to replace it in a month, I, I don't care. It's one pound. Um, talking about pounds, uh, I had one before, and then I, for my pennies, I keep everything like 20p or higher in my in my purse but all the little coins they go into uh they should go into a money box but i just tend to keep them and uh, they're all over the flat and annoy my husband so i wanted to buy one a few weeks ago but they didn't have any pretty ones and this one says totally essential items fund shoes clothes on holiday and it's got all like money and it's got backpacks and makeup and shoes on it and i think it's quite cute so I'm gonna, it's not gonna take much. I think the last one I had, I had about 50 pounds in there, but hey, it's enough for a new outfit. So I'm gonna start saving my pennies again. Uh, the other one, I bought some kitchen essentials. Um, shredded, shredded box grater, um, simply because I need the grater for my um, courgette hash browns uh, that I'll be making later today. And I used to use the spiralizer, but it, obviously the, the bits are quite long and uh, it's not quite the texture I want it to be. Um, roasting tins, I always buy them from Pound Shop. Uh, this one is 25 centimeters and it's uh, one pound, obviously. I needed a small one for when I'm just roasting veg and stuff, so that was perfect. Um, shower gel for hubby. Um, imperial leather energizing gel for men he loves it it's his favorite one 
and it was one pound so normally it's the half of the size is one pound right at the moment for like a month or two they have two like the big size um for one pound so i keep buying it um set of kitchen knives i don't expect them to be really sharp but sometimes if i make things like pork chops and stuff like that uh, i don't like the big knife that i use in the kitchen to cut meat as we put on the table so i just bought them they should be sharp enough to to cut uh, meat when we're eating dinner um i got rid some time ago of all my like plastic container to keep food in the fridge and I'm going back to meal planning, meal prepping at the moment. And um, I want to, as I'm eating keto diet, my husband is not. I'm trying to cook uh, like bigger portions of food for him and keep them uh, so he can have them on the days. I really don't want to cook uh, food that will tempt me like pasta and rice. So then they have plastic ones. They have a pack of eight of these. They like takeaway containers um which is not perfect because i can't reuse them but i can use the big pot of uh cook big pot of jollof rice packet and then he'll have it for a few days i can i believe i can even put it in the freezer in this container so that's still good that's the first bag gone um bandage because he injured himself when he was playing football a few days ago so he asked me to buy him bandage. Um, he injured himself and he's out um, with his boys uh, playing football. Apparently they play and he is a referee. I'm pretty sure it is because when I called him 10 minutes ago, uh, he decided to be funny and then just blow the whistle in my head. So it's very like in my ear. A very, very lovely husband I have. Uh, chicken breast slices. Uh, yes, I know I just did the massive food shopping and... Um, my fridge and freezer are full but i just like having one of them uh, in the fridge at work so i can keep it there if i ever feel that i want to snack on something during the day and i don't and i already had my lunch or i'm not hungry enough to have my lunch i want to have that in the fridge at work one pound obviously uh, oh no there were some two for one pound items in there which i have in here Obviously, there, there won't be a trip to Poundland without these two beauties. Big bag of pork scratchings. They're my favorite ones. Two for a pound. I have four bags of them. So they are somewhere at the bottom, the other two. Uh, slide lock food bags. I just used the last one uh, of this size when I was um, unpacking my shopping and putting it away. So it's, I think, 15 bags. They're quite big and it's I think it's 15 of them. Yeah, pack of 16. As you can see um bean bags i don't think they're great but just needed i think i need some i always think that i need some and then i look somewhere in the kitchen and there is another roll of them but oh well we'll have the spare one um buy them every month they always negative but hey when you're trying to conceive you take one million pregnancy tests a month just in case so it's three of them for a pound um that's for happy honey roasted cashews i love them and he loves them but i can't have them because they're the carbohydrates co oh my god yeah that's like my two days worth or three days worth of carbs um in this one pack so i won't be touching them but what i have for myself it's um ground almonds and what i buy them some people use them for cooking and baking i buy them because uh almond flour it's quite expensive it's hard to find and i use i only use it when i want to uh do like a coating for something or uh to, to add them to my um instead of flour to my uh zucchini hash brown mix uh the carb uh i literally use the one little tablespoon of, i mean teaspoon of them and uh it will be like one or two grams of carbs it doesn't change the like once i add all the spices to it the food still tastes like it should taste it doesn't taste sweet i know some people and including me before i used it i were thinking oh my god i was thinking like oh my god it's gonna be like really sweet because it's ground almond no once you add all the spices they change the flavor and uh, you don't taste it at all so that's a little tip if you don't want to spend too much money on keto one pound um for ground almonds um if i'm sending the parcel i need a cello cello tape um the smallest one they had and once again it will be just around the house annoying us but it's 
four, five rolls for one pound. I uh, don't need five rolls, but that's what they had in there. Um, AAA batteries. Why? Why? Why not? Because I always use them, and we always seem to be running out of them. And I like to stock up on them. So, um, AAA batteries. Baby wipes. I love having them around the house, even though we don't have babies. I like to use them to remove my makeup or just just to refresh my face. And sometimes. So, um, Huggies, they normally one for a pound, and now they have them on offer, three pack for uh, two pounds. So, that was the only two pound item I bought, and uh, that will, they will last me long enough. I don't think I'll have to buy them next month because I still have half a pack from the last haul. Um, that's for Hubby Free Spray. Once again, he used it for his injuries and stuff, so that should help with his um, injured leg. Um, Second lot of pork scratchings, once again two for a pound. Um, snack for me, pepperami sticks, uh, they were three for a pound. Obviously, normally in the supermarkets you have a pack of five, but they cost two pounds, two, sometimes more than that. They the, they the peppered beef high in protein, three pack. Um, Two and a half grams of carb and 100 grams. Okay, so it's half a gram of carb in each of them. So that's an amazing snack to keep in my handbag if I ever want to snack on something. Um, pink salt. Uh, pink rock salt grinder. My hubby loves grinders lately. Just like So um, I needed some pink salt anyway. A pound. So I don't even know how much they are in Tesco. Because last time I looked and I was like, oh no, I'm not paying that for salt. I thought I had a bruise on my face. I think it's just the light falling a certain way. Um, I don't drink much soda because it's not good for me. And I, if I drink, I drink like Coke Zero, but they didn't have any. And I just wanted to have a few cans on the days when I just want this sweet flavor without uh, having anything with uh, the actual sugars. So I bought myself three cans, three per pound of Pepsi Max Cherry. Um, as I say, I'm not a massive fan of uh, Pepsi, but they were like three for a pound, so hey. Um, now the essential, don't have to explain what it is, email wash. Um, I have a few bits, as I mentioned, not for me. I mean, one is for me because I want to test it. But um, that's for my mom, because so... Just to make it easier when she's talking to me, I have exactly the same one. It's the little tripod, so she can use it when when she's sitting on her chair. Because she tempted, she she sit on the on this armchair, and then she's got her phone balancing on something like a book or something, and then she's leaning forward, and she's got problems with her back. So I wanted to sit back, feel comfy, like I'm sitting right now, and have the tripod and just put her phone sideways, and we can talk. And uh, the other one, because my hubby said, why don't you get her the other one as well? Maybe she will like it too, because he's got one and he loves it. Uh, yeah, like sometimes he's using it when he's laying in bed and then have his tablet next to him on the side. She can put her phone si or tablet sideways and use it. So that's for her. And uh, as it's too late for uh, Mother's Day in here, I don't have a Mother's Day card. And it's um, it's not her birthday, and uh, there is no such thing as name day. It's all being celebrated here in UK, so I, I decided to buy her some cards. There were two for a pound. There's one with flowers, and the other one with a little beautiful teacup and flowers. So I can send her a card as well in my little parcel. Um, little mascara. I don't need one, but I was buying her some makeup, and I was like, oh, why not? I can add it as well. My mum. Uh, likes makeup but she hates spending money on makeup for some reason she doesn't spend money on makeup so i bully her like if i go to poland i will, buy, I will go to like rossman which is their version of super drag and i just buy her shit lots of uh things uh so she can mold so um i bought her bag full of makeup from uh super drag uh not bag full but quite a few things that i know that she doesn't like spending money on and she can do it having some and uh, she works hard she's on her feet eight hours a day at work and uh, i just wanted to make this um this um this gift a bit of a, like a pumper set so i bought her a few of these i've tried some of them but not all of them 
So there is Argan Oil Food Pack, the little booties that you put on your plate, keep it for 20 minutes and they make your skin so nice and soft. So we have two Argan Oil ones, we have tea tree and peppermint, two of them, and we have honey and almond one. I've never tried this one, I'm keeping one for myself to try it and one for her. And uh, soft and smooth improves texture face mask, they the sheet mask. Um, never tried this ones before, and even though I know the brand. Uh, so there were two for two, one pound each, not two for a pound, they're one pound each, so I'm sending one for mommy, keeping one for myself. So that's it, that's this month's Poundland haul, uh, it's gonna take me forever now to put it away. Um, I don't think I'll be going to Poundland again uh, before like the end of April payday, maybe just for some essentials like toilet paper and washing up liquid. But yeah, quite happy, spent quite a bit of money, but as I say, like 10, 12 pounds maybe um, were the things for my mom and for my hubby as well that I won't even be using, but 40 pounds is not that bad and um, and I won't be spending any more money on, on things like that this month. So hey, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you in my next uh, video.